I see people all the time. I'm doing keto now. I've done it for six weeks. I've lost 52 pounds. I'm like, yeah, I'll see you in uh, week seven. Why is that? I'm into it. I'll see you in week seven. Seven weeks later, I see them in the drive-thru with an uh, OJ mask on, disguise themselves, and they eat a McFlurry. <laughs> right. And I'm going, what the hell's going on? This is The Thriving Dentist Show with Gary Takas, where we help you develop your ideal dental practice. I'll work out with a, with a couple of dentists. They'll say, ooch. That wasn't too hard. I was expecting it was going to be like a Viking, you know, Navy SEAL kick butt yoga. <laughs> right. And I'm like, you know what? I've been doing this for 40 years. I've never broken a bone. I have very few injuries. And I can go again tomorrow. And they're like, but it makes sense to them. At the same time, I wish I worked out a little harder. I said, well, you keep working, you know, balls to the wall, hard as you want. Right. And I'll see in the next year who's still exercising. And those intense boot camp style, intense raw booyah, Hell Week, is it Hell Week? Navy SEALs, they're called Hell Week, Navy yeah. SEAL training. Yeah. It's Hell Week. It's not Hell Year. It's not Hell Decade. <laughs> right. So right. If your workout is Hell Decade, Navy SEALs only do a week of it. So I, I'm all about turning back the intensity, periodizing your training, hiring a certified trainer to periodize your workout properly. You can't just keep getting stronger year round. Just like you can't keep working on one aspect of your practice year round. There's many types of modes and places to work on in a practice other than production, you know, right. um, fulfillment, um, community involvement, um, uh, CE, um, staff development. There's many ways. So I think when it comes to fitness, a lot of people who don't haven't studied it just think more is better. And more is better is so far off the beaten path. I see people all the time. I'm doing keto now. I've done it for six weeks. I've lost 52 pounds. I'm like, yeah, I'll see you in uh, week seven. Why is that? I'm into it. I'll see you in week seven. Seven weeks later, I see them in the drive-thru with an uh, OJ mask on, disguise themselves, and they eat a McFlurry. <laughs> right. And I'm going, what the hell's going on? So um, people need to periodize their training, and all or nothing workouts is actually as stressful as watching news that you don't enjoy. So um, restorative exercise is key. And you know, that's, it's, a whole, it's another discussion, obviously, it's just attenuating, but just giving people permission, you don't always have to work out super hard to get a result. You don't always have to work out super intense to get a result, right? That, that's, that's a key takeaway for anyone who just thinks going full out is better than restorative gentle exercise. One that provides personal, professional, and financial satisfaction. 